So after the presentation of the iPhone X with Face ID and everyone saw the fail of Face ID. He is looking at it and swiping up. And you know, let's try that again. Ho ho ho! And yes, it was a fail, but maybe it's not a fail that you expect of. So let me explain. I even made a video uh, after the presentation saying that Face ID might have failed or maybe didn't fail. And I have saw in the past days so many comments on Facebook, on other blogs and even on my video. People insulting others for saying you douchebags. When you start the phone, it asks you a passcode to enable Face ID or previously Touch ID, the fingerprint scanner, and many people saying the same thing over and over, even though I I was always saying, but wait, if you enter a fingerprint that don't have scanned and you enter it for it like five times and it's the wrong one, then it will also ask you to enter your pin code because you entered the wrong finger. In this case, with Face ID, it's the same thing. If you enter a wrong face uh, several times, then it will ask you the passcode which is what happened, but I kept saying that over and over and most of people were completely saying like no, the device was restarted and uh, that's, that's it. Like people know already what happened there. Nobody knows what happened there, only the guys at Apple know what happened there. In fact, Apple came already with a statement on what happened there. But my sister uses iPhone and also iPads. She's an Apple hardcore user. And I asked her, use a finger that you don't have scanned on your iPhone. And this is the screen. Your passcode is required to enable Touch ID. Because well, the iPhone scanned several faces which were wrong. The device wasn't restarted like many people were saying. In fact, Apple came out with a statement and said uh, people were handling the device for stage demo ahead of time and didn't realize Face ID was trying to authenticate their face. After failing a number of times bec because they weren't Craig, the iPhone did what it was designed to, which was to require his passcode. In other words, Face ID worked as it was designed to. So this is what I was saying most of the times previously with Touch ID, with fingerprint scanner, if you enter wrongly for a few times then it will ask you the passcode which in this case with the face id it's the same you enter the wrong face several times and well it asks you the passcode and not what many people are saying which the device was restarted yes when you start your device it will also ask you the passcode to enable face id or in older iphones to enable the fingerprint scanner but well fanboys always gonna be fanboys to enable face id you just have to raise your phone and the phone will scan your face but anyway, let me know guys what you think in the comments and I'll see you on the next one.